Uh-huh. Arlette, have you ever done any speed reading? No, but my brother has. What's the idea behind speed reading? We just skim through it quickly and get the main idea. Mm -hmm. Well, I have a phrase here on the other side of this card. I'm going to hold it up very quickly, and I want you to read it as quickly as you can. Tell me what it says. Are you okay. ready? A dog is man's best friend. You sure? Yeah. Okay, I'll do it again. Take another look. A dog is man's best friend. Positive. Yeah, I'm sure. Okay, I'll do it a little more slowly this time. Oh, a dog is, is man's best friend. You sure now? Mm, that's what it said. Okay, take a good close look at it. A dog is, is man's best friend. Okay, take another look at it. <laughs> a dog is man's best fiend. Oh. <laughs> Well, this is what everybody does. When they try to read fast, your eye skims over it and you get only the important words. And be, I chose a phrase like this because it's a common one and you know, almost you often have to, to have dog and man and you can almost get the rest of it. So you jump to conclusions. So the point is when you're reading fast, that's fine. But if you're trying to read to correct things, like proofreading, then you have to read very slowly. Otherwise your eye would go right over it and find that missing R when it wasn't there. Yeah, same thing my teacher says. What? Well, we read our stories, you know, so he gives it to someone else to read because mm -hmm. we usually just, you know, yeah, I know what it says. Mm -hmm. so. so she said when you're proofreading it, read very slowly. Yeah. Right.